Mike, downtown Marlin is working to bounce back after destructive fire this weekend. Fox 44's PJ Hessner spoke with the city of Marlin and neighboring businesses about their plan for the future. Business resumes as usual today in downtown Marlin after nearly two days of the area being shut down because of a fire that destroyed the business right behind me Sunday morning. Around 8.30 Sunday morning, an off-duty firefighter noticed smoke coming out of the Fluffy Unicorn, a business that sells custom t-shirts. I understand they're really nice people and it was just real tra tragedy. Fire crews quickly made sure the fire didn't spread to surrounding businesses. Libba Merriman manages the Samaritan House a few doors down from where the fire occurred. She found out about the fire on Facebook. And I thought, oh no, not a Marlin, another Marlin downtown fire. And it sort of scared me because it's just right down the road. She was surprised to find her workplace still standing despite how close the fire was. Everything was fine when I got here. The uh, freezers are working and the lights were on and we were all good. She was nervous for her business because it sits in the fragile historic downtown. These buildings are so old and uh, just a spark would just probably take it away. A few firefighters were treated for minor injuries and released, but no one else was hurt in the fire. A state marshal came to assess the damage and attempt to determine the cause of the fire. It was so much damage that more than likely it, it will probably go undetermined because of the, you know, the, the amount of damage. As downtown opens back up, the businesses closest to the fire, including the one behind me, remains closed. Now, the reason for the fire is still under investigation, but we will keep you updated live and on our website at fox44news.com. In Marlin, I'm PJ Hessner, Fox 44 News.